This is the Nextbit Robin, a smartphone that builds itself as a device that will never run out of space. It's an Android phone, but Nextbit has skinned the operating system in a way that looks and behaves more like an iPhone. You see a simple grid of apps that you can cluster into folders. You bring up app widgets by pinching across the screen. And Google Now on Tap, which scans what's on the screen to predict what you might go for next, is triggered with a long press of the home button. The stylish matte plastic and squarish design give the Robin a unique look. And the sleep-wake button doubles as a fingerprint sensor. The Robin's 5.2-inch 1080p display looks great, though it's not as pixel-packed as higher-priced phones from Samsung and Apple. The Robin's camera is similarly competent, but not jaw-dropping. The 13-megapixel rear and 5-megapixel front camera take decent photos in both bright and low light, but they're not as good as the cameras on today's best phones. This is more of a letdown given the phone's pitch that I'll never have to worry about storage. Photos and videos are my biggest space hogs. When the phone's 32 gigabytes are almost full, it recognizes what apps and photos you use and which you don't. The unloved items move over to a 100 gigabyte cloud drive the company offers each of its users. If you want to go back to an app, you can pick up right where you left off. It's a slick trick for people tired of running out of space on their phones, but I fill up my phone shooting photos and videos, which I'd prefer not to shoot on the Robin. Hopefully, Nextbit's next phone will have a better camera. Until then, it's a great experiment for living in the cloud.